Hi everybody, welcome back. It's your boy, Sir Drake Salon. Today's drink of choice, and I do mean choice, is liquid death. Bury it all. I'll bury it alive. Sorry I said bury it all. Um, 20 calories, zero grams of fat, three grams of carbs, where three from sugars. Yeah, this is uh, this ruthless tall boy of flavored sparkling waters armed with the agave nectar and natural electrolytes. This is just the same thing as last time, so doesn't say anything about the berry, just how sweet the juice is, you know what I'm saying? Of course you understand what I'm saying. Why wouldn't you? That's just silly. Let's give this a shot, shall we? Shoot to kill. Murder your thirst. Oh, I love that smell. That's a good smell. bad it's not bad at all I don't I don't know I like the lime just because it kind of reminded me of having a lime like a like a lime Bud Light like a lime beer the strawberry though is okay It's definitely chuggable. It has a nice aftertaste. Like the you know that strawberry is what you're tasting. But I really wish that I were drinking that I were chewing into a strawberry. You know, that I had like a strawberry blended in, in you know strawberry should be in here. Is what I'm, is what I'm, is what I'm trying to say. So It's not bad. I like it. Um, I'm trying to think if I actually kind of like with the lime. If I if I saw it again, um, would I choose it over the lime? Uh, maybe, maybe not. I think that what I would like to do in some of these is to try these mixed with like my favorite beverage, like other other beverages, to have that other flavor in there. You know. Like have this with some Coke. Like a strawberry Coke, you know? Um, or as I, as we were talking to somebody, they're actually having the syrup. Like if you got some Coke syrup, put a little Coke syrup in the strawberry carbonated water, get you a strawberry Coke. I would like that. That would be kind of neat. Same thing with the lime. Just have that available. So, okay. It doesn't, to me, I don't get that same kind of dry aftertaste, that, that dry mouth, you know, and that's it. It's not as bad. But, I mean, what are you going to do? Uh, it's, 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 it's nice. It's, it's, it's sweet. It's not too sweet. It could be sweet. I, I'll tell you that right now. But then if it were more sweet, it wouldn't be a sparkling water. It'd be like a soda. Which I don't think would be a bad bad thing. This is a... This tastes real good. I really I really do like this. Um, honestly, I think I might just give it the same as I, I did the, the berry. Excuse me. I mean the lime. Oh, goodness. Like I said, I, I gave the lime... Four and an eight, because you know it was it what it reminds me. Of. Like it's a, a good old beer, you know, with a little, a little lime, and it was a really good flavor. Now, if I were normally doing the lime, I probably would have done it like one point lower. But it was just so cool that I just I kind of give it a, a four and an eight. And the strawberries are actually pretty decent too. Um, and the problem is, is that I feel like I'm going to be harsh with the mango, because that's the last one. I saved that one for last, but it might be better. I have 
have to say, this does not make me taste beer. It doesn't give me that beer flavor, you know, that I'm expecting. Um, like I said, if this were just a little sweeter, this would be a neat little drink, you know. I think same thing with the lime. Um, like a, it would almost be a, it's like a Seven Up, and this is like some kind of a strawberry cola, you know. But uh, like a light, light cola. Uh, oh goodness, what? Uh, man, I really don't know. Like score wise, I kind of. It's I'm more likely. I think a lot of these should probably have been like they should be threes and sevens. Um, this is where these should all kind of be so far. That's my gut, but I like them so well. Like these are really, this is a really good flavor. I like the fact that these even exist, uh, and that's kind of pushing me over a little bit. So let's preface these these liquid death flavors. So far, I would give them threes and sevens, but. Because this is so cool, because the drink is so good, I also didn't cut the box up yet, so I don't have the label. I don't have the the cover and stuff, which I will have. Um, and uh, uh, yeah, that's, that's gonna be that's gonna be good. Because uh, I think, let's see, I think the uh, I don't know if that, I just like, took them out of the box. I didn't even look at the thing. I think it's red though, red lettering with the skull on the box. And then gold for the mango, the yellowish color. So yeah, now the back art I didn't see. That's going to be interesting. But I'll make like a little collage thing and maybe put some stuff up on the on a wall in a, in a frame or something. But at this particular point, I'm going to go ahead and give it a four and an eight. Strawberry liquid death is awesome. As I've said before, I, I think base level should be a three and a seven. Um, like I said, there's maybe even a possibility that because of the lime, maybe the, the lime should have been a three and a six, but honestly, I think a three and a seven would be like, that's where it was if it wasn't so fucking cool. That's just, you know, some people are born with talent, I'm just saying. So, as always, I am Sir Drinks Alive, and I am wishing you health, wealth, and love with enough time and gusts to enjoy it all down to the last drop. You guys have been awesome, and I will catch you guys in the next video.